You need a gun. Oftentimes, it's not this Hollywood scene of shooting down the road or across the store. Real self-defense is up close. The FBI is established within only three yards. So that's plenty close enough to where somebody could grab you. They got you held up against something you can't draw. But we went a step further. The worst case scenario attack is from where? Behind you. You don't know it's even coming. You have no way to prepare. You just, boom, you got somebody shoving you up against something. You're on the ground with them. You got 200 pounds on you. Trying to get a gun is going to be much harder when you're in a fight and you got that 200 pounds fighting against you. So the idea is with this is if you can't draw up, you can't draw up, you can't move your arm, can't move your arm, your gun's doing you no good. So with that being said, with this, all you have to do is just rock. Rock your wrist. That's all it takes now. With that being said, here's how this works. It's that open channel design, the breakout design. Instead of relying on a draw when your life's on the line, all you have to do is just rock your wrist. Rock your wrist, you can power forward, you can draw straight up and down, whatever you're used to. And you're probably wondering, oh, is that secure? Listen, just listen to this real quick. It still clicks in. Your gun's still in the holster, it's not dropping out on you. This here, it could take a hit. You're in that fight, this thing can take a beating, it's not leaving. Your gun is fully secure. With that being said, all you do is rock, you're good to go. You need to power forward, you power forward. If you already have the muscle memory of vertical draw, there you go, vertical draw, it's there for you. As far as everyday comfort goes, oftentimes whenever you get jabbed or poked with a holster, it's because you have these squared out edges down here, squared out, squared out, squared out. Uh, same thing with this square 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 you got and then you got the sweat guard oh my gosh you might as well call it a pinch guard because here's the thing with this same gun right here's the thing you see how this is poking out away from your body and it comes up the skin naturally fills it in it naturally fills in that gap see if you catch that skin in between a sharp piece of plastic and a metal gun that is not going to be a good day that is what you're going to be feeling whenever you're going to carry with one of these so we've eliminated the sweat shield the excessive bolt the sharp edges we're not using these these little garbage little freaking plastic clips that are bulky for no reason see how far that sticks out look at the breakout look at this look at that double steel clip compared to that plastic clip that's double the security plus steel plus it's thinner way more concealed they actually believe in excessive concealment and here's what excessive concealment means you see how that has that hole right there that's going to give you adjustable cantability, meaning you can cant this clip 18 degrees, keeping that center line of that gun closer to your body. So for bigger guns or smaller people, that gives you extra concealment and options. But additional to that, when it comes to the extra options, you see this concealment claw right here. What this bad boy does is it leverages against your belt, pushing the gun closer to your body keeping it nice and tight printing up against you. Now you have two pieces of excessive concealment plus a minimalist design, absolute minimalist design. Also for customizability, don't wear a belt. You can also get a clamping clip, which because I do have a belt on, I'm using this to simulate the waistband. You clamp it down over top of the waistband, clamp it, boom, it's secure. It's not going anywhere. Draw, your gun's still there for you no matter what. It's still clamped, you're all good to go. Houdini Breakout 2.0 is gonna offer those features of adjustable cantability, that concealment claw, clamping clip, uh, all the, the three-way breakout design, all of it. So if you would like to pre-order your 2.0 today, feel free, you can pre-order the day and they'll be going live on what we plan to be November 18th. Thank you very much. Click, click the link, the swipe up, whatever the platform is you're on, feel free to, to take that action.